And again, Cedar Creek Road is washed out again. If anybody wants to go tubing, you can get in up there at the top of the hill. You end up down there. any decent amount of rain and the road does this. But nobody try to come down Cedar Creek Road because if you come down it, you ain't probably going to get down it. Done had to pull one person out today. I mean, this is every time it rains. It's like a river. What is that? A hose pipe. Ridiculous. Every time it rains, it does this. I'm about to go with my shoes and it did. Wonderful. What's that? What the heck? what it's for. This is just ridiculous. I can't go any further. I can't go any further. It's deep right there. My feet wet. It's... Hold on. Get down the way. It's deep right there. Let 
Don't do like that. <laughs> There's two or three foot of water running down through there right there on both sides. Both sides. It's all coming from the polo field across the road. I mean, look at this. Look at the bank just falling off up there in the hayfield. Just falling off because the water's eating out into the bank. No, it's not our driveway. This is our dirt road. And yeah, I know. We already don't have a road. But you can't pass it until you get up here, which I mean, it's pointless for us. We have to go out the other way. If we had an emergency, we'd be screwed. There's some big piece of metal something right there. This big old slab of concrete. Where'd this come from? I know, I know, look at it, it's just falling. Look at this big piece of concrete. I don't know where that came from. A big piece. Some more right there. I bet that's two or three feet deep. Okay. That post is going to fall over next. And they just fixed this last week. Well, excuse me, patched it. They never fix it. It's always just a patch. And every bit of it's coming from that farm across the road because they don't have any retention ponds. And all just runs straight down here. Just a mess. But nobody try to come down to the creek road. Because you ain't gonna make it down it.